Welcome sa sip9.com this video ay tutuloy natin yung ating series on operations on polynomial uh, expressions, no? I think this will be the last video in the series, no? And uh, dito sa video na to ay solve natin tong problem na to, no? So we have 8 to the 4th divided, or oh, 8 to the 4th minus 2 divided by 8 plus 1. So, although na hindi ko naturo previously, pag may mga laktaw yung exponent, diba sabi natin dapat yung variable ay decreasing exponent siya dapat, Ilalagay din natin yung mga missing na, uh, yung variables na may missing exponents. Talagyan na natin siya ng 0, no? So, for example, a to the 4th minus 2. Missing yung a cubed, a uh, squared, a to the 1st power, tsaka, oh, tama, yung tatlong yun, missing, di ba? So, pwede natin yung ilagay na a to the 4th, um, uh, magiging plus 0 a cubed, no? So, wala naman siya, no? Plus 0a squared plus a and then, yung nandito na, no? So, oh, plus 0a pala, sorry. So, plus 0a to the first power minus 2. So, 4, 3, 2, 1. Tapos dito, wala na. No? So, later, makikita nyo kung bakit kailangan natin gawin yan, no? So, divided by a plus 1. Okay, so naka-decreasing na lahat yung um, exponents. Ah, by the way, yung mga rules yan, yung mga strategies like decreasing exponents, diniscuss ko na siya sa mga previous video. So, mas maganda na kompletohin nyo itong series na to kung gusto nyo talaga maintindihan kasi hindi ko naman pwede ipaliwanag na lang every time. So, we already have decreasing exponents. Decreasing na rin dito. So, we divide the leading uh, leading term, no? Yung a to the 4th, tsaka a. So, a to the 4th divided by a is a cubed, diba? So, a cubed. So, a cubed, multiply natin sa a plus 1, no? So, we have a cubed times a is a to the 4th. And then a cubed, we have a plus here, so magkakaroon tayo ng plus. And then a cubed plus 1 is a cubed. No? So, napansin nyo, kailangan natin decrease exponent kasi kailangan natin itapat yung mga corresponding uh, terms na may parehong o na may decreasing exponents then For example, kung nag-minus 2 agad tayo dito, wala na tayong tatapat ng a-cube natin. No? So that's the reason kung bakit uh, nilalagyan natin ng 0 yung missing terms. No? Pag yung divisor mo ay may, may uh, missing terms, then dapat may 0 din siya. No? So, so we subtract, no? So a fourth, a to the fourth minus a to the fourth is zero, and then we have zero a cubed minus uh, a cubed. So zero minus a cubed, jan di ba? So that is negative a cubed. So this is negative a cubed. Tapos si bring down natin yung zero a squared, no? okay? And then yung negative a cubed naman, divide naman natin siya by a, no? So that is negative. Is it negative a squared? Yes, negative a squared. So, negative a squared plus negative a squared. Actually, pwede nang i-minus yan, but uh, we, are, we are doing addition. So, negative a squared times a is negative a cubed. And then, plus negative a squared times 1 is negative a squared. So, ma-minus natin, we have negative a cubed minus negative a cubed is 0. No? This is a uh, uh, term my, uh, subtracted from itself. No? So, 0 siya. Then we have 0 a squared minus negative 0 a squared minus negative a squared. No? Nakikita nyo, 0 a squared minus negative a squared. So, this becomes, magiging plus yan, diba? Yung dalawang yan. So, magiging 0 a squared plus a squared. So, magiging positive a squared yan. Bring down yung 0 a. No? Okay? Tapos, lastly, we divide a squared by a, di ba? So, divide natin itong a squared, yung leading terms, a squared divided by a. So, magiging a na lang, no? So, this is positive a. So, a times a is a squared. And then, we have a plus a times 1 is a. Okay? 
and then we subtract okay so a squared minus a squared is a squared and then 0a minus a is negative a and then bring down 2 no minus 2 diba okay so pinaka last na gagawin natin is to divide this term by a no? so negative a over a is negative 1 diba so plus negative 1 dito okay minus 1 din kung gusto niyo pwede lang pero usually mas maganda to kasi hindi siya nakakalito so negative 1 times a is negative a tapos negative 1 plus negative 1 times 1 is negative 1. Okay, so subtract natin again. Negative a minus negative a is 0. Negative 2 minus negative 1 is negative 1. That is negative 2 minus negative 1. Negative 2 plus 1 equals negative 1. Diba? Yes, negative. So meron tayong remainder. Bali yung quotient natin, a squared, oh sorry, a cubed, plus negative a squared minus, pwede na yung gawing minus kasi ano na, diba? Uh, quotient na siya. Pinaka-final answer. So, minus a squared plus a minus 1. Okay? So, yung plus negative, nagiging minus siya pag sa answer na. Pero, pag nagsusold pa lang tayo, mas maganda kung yung a minus 1 o a minus b, kagawin nating a plus negative b. Mas madali kasi siyang madistinguish yung minus from the negative sign. Oh, sorry. A minus 1. Minus 1 to dito. Tapos may remainder tayo na remainder negative 1. Okay? So, pag may remainder tayo, anong ginagawa natin? Pwede na yan, di ba? Pwede na itong remainder negative 1. Pero mathematically, mas sinusulat natin siya na um, a cubed minus 1. Oh, sorry. A cubed minus a squared plus a minus 1 plus negative 1 over. Ano yung divisor natin? Di ba? A plus 1. Divided by a plus 1. So, para nag-divide tayo na number. 35 divided by 4. Diba? 8. 32, 3. Ito yung remainder natin. Diba? Ito yung remainder natin. Kasi ito naman yung ating divisor. Ang divisor natin, kung maalala nyo, divided by 8 plus 1. So, diba? 8 and 3 fourths. So, pinaplus natin actually dito sa whole number. Kaya natin siya pinaplus dito. 8 and 3 fourth means 8 plus 3 fourth. Kaya natin siya ina dito. Pero since negative siya, pwede na natin siyang gawing a cubed minus a squared plus a minus 1, plus negative yan, di ba? So, ibig sabihin, pwede na tayo mag minus 1 over a plus 1. Okay, so that's it. Yan na yung uh, pinaka class itong video na to, no? Uh, may tutura ako sa inyo yung um, synthetic division, pero for a specific type of uh, ano siya, polynomials. Uh, pero, I don't know kung yan na yung susunod natin na video because I'm planning to teach uh, GeoGebra no? pa, kung paano mag-graph para magamit nyo sa pag-aaral nyo. Maraming salamat. Gusto ko yung invite sa sipnayan.com yung ating website. At gusto ko rin kayong uh, invite na mag-subscribe sa ating YouTube channel. Uh, marami na tayong videos. Just explore, uh, share to your friends, and then like o kaya mag-comment kaya kung mayroon kayong tanong. Maraming salamat. See you in the next tutorial.